What's up guys, Parker here. I have a very quick video for you today showing you how to identify positive and negative values in a bar chart or really any chart, but uh, I think it looks best in a bar chart. So you see right now I have this bar chart with just black bars. I want to create it uh, with green bars as positives and red bars as negatives. It's actually really easy to set up. Uh, so we just go ahead and go over to the formatting pane and go to data colors. So the default color just changes it to one color. Um, but we can color now with conditional formatting. So if we go ahead and color based on rules, we'll select the measure that's showing in our graph. I have a measure called percent change. And we can set it up just like normal conditional formatting. So if it's greater than or equal to minimum, but less than, let's say, negative zero point, uh, we'll say less than zero, um, or less than or equal to zero, we'll make that red. If it's greater than zero but less than or equal to maximum we'll make that green and that's pretty much all we have to do there so you see positive bars are green negative bars are red and it looks awesome uh, one extra little step let's go ahead and add one more intermediate rule so let's go ahead and less make this less than negative 0 0.1 um, greater than or equal to negative 0 0.1 less than or equal to positive 0 0.1 and greater than 0 0.1 to give us kind of an intermediate yellow range. Let's go ahead and see what that looks like. And that's awesome. So now we see uh, the positive values, the in-between values, and the very negative values. So that's a quick way that we can conditionally format a bar chart to be able to show us um, really what's positive and what's negative. Hope you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video.